so Sarami, I got to wonder, uh, and Shingo and I were just talking about it because I had to find out uh, the translation of the nick- the Sarami nickname, which translates to salami in English, which uh, is a sausage, <laughs> a sausage meat. So I got to know, how did this, uh, where'd you get this nickname? I need to know the story. <laughs> あの、食べ物のサラミとはま、全く関係ないんです。で、え、ちょっと待って。<笑><笑> So uh, my, my name is Satomi, and when you put it into alpha, alphabet letters, it didn't look cute at all. <laughs> so I changed the T-O to L-A, and uh, that's how, that's how uh, I got my nickname. Okay. <laughs> all right. So it makes a lot more sense. I was, as a, you know, an English speaker, an American, I was assuming you were a very big fan of salami, but uh, not, that's not the case. <laughs> <laughs> all right, had to get that out of the way. It's all clarified now. So, uh, and I want to go back to uh, your last fight as well, which, you know, was that title win uh, in your trilogy fight with Mina Kurobe, who, you know, had the two wins over you previously, one of the veterans of the sport, a pioneer of the division, all that. Uh, for you, I mean, just what was that moment like? Just the feeling of not only becoming champion, but also, you know, finally beating Mina, who you'd fought twice before that fight. So I didn't really feel that I became champion from winning that fight. Um, but for me, it was more about um, the, the, the relief. And I couldn't believe I actually fought five rounds. So that was my first uh, initial response after that win. Okay. All right. So would you consider it... Uh, maybe your proudest victory then, or would that go to a, a different one? <laughs> yeah, uh, winning that winning that title uh, against uh, Mina Kurobe was definitely my proudest win. That's certainly a good one, and you'll have the chance for another potentially big and good one here against Kana Asakura, which is a, you know, a great debut fight for you and somebody that if you beat her, you'll be right up there in that mix of you know the top Adam Waits uh, fighting, trying to fight for the title. So I'm sure you're familiar with Kana, but uh, just what was your reaction to you know getting her as your uh, first opponent in the Ryzen Ring? Well, <laughs> yeah, so I think uh, she's a well-rounded fighter. Uh, everything is based off of her uh, wrestling background. And uh, she definitely has that experience fighting in Ryzen uh, for a majority of her career. Obviously, she's, she's the winner of the Grand Prix, the tournament. So she's not a weak opponent. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, she's kind of in an interesting spot where she's kind of struggled a little bit, at least in terms of her results uh, recently. So do you think that's going to make her even more dangerous coming into a fight with you where, you know, she really kind of uh, needs to get back in the win column? I feel that uh, she, her mind is definitely set straight on this one. And that's, that's how I feel. Oh, hey, you made it to the end. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. If you like this video and want to see more like it, give it a like and maybe subscribe if you haven't already. Until then, we'll see you next time.